Hey, I just got this video from a guy that purchased one of our vehicle diagnostic kits. He went to check out the condition of his 2004 Chevy Venture minivan. There were no dash lights on and there were no indication that there was anything wrong with his vehicle. In the video, you can see that he gets a fault code. Continue watching to see what happens. His 2004 Chevy Venture minivan. He locates the OBD plug-in, which is below the steering wheel. He plugs in the wireless Bluetooth OBD connector, which is included in the Elite kit. He makes sure it is plugged in all the way. He will turn the van's ignition to the on position, and he gets his cell phone. In this case, he is using a Samsung Galaxy Note. He taps the app icon. He then presses the check fault codes icon. And the software begins to check out the van's system. The screen reads, reading fault code responses. The video was paused for a short time, so you didn't have to wait for the software to go through all the different system checks. And as you can see, it pulled up a fault code pertaining to the coolant's thermostat. When you click on this code, you will have the option to close it or do a web lookup. When he chooses the web lookup, it goes immediately to a page that describes the fault code in more detail. And there are even more sites as you can see. In this case, it gives the technical description. And you can read, what does this mean? Symptoms, causes, and even possible solutions. There are also links to other sites, like special forums with other people who have had this problem and how they went about fixing it. Now, like I said in the beginning, there were no dash lights on and there were no indication that there was anything wrong with his vehicle. In the video, you see that he gets a fault code which indicates that the thermostat in his vehicle is failing. Most people will not know something is wrong until the engine overheats. And often, when the engine overheats, the radiator can develop a leak. A hose can burst and even cause the engine to seize up, leaving you stranded alongside the road in the middle of nowhere, which can cause a lot of heartaches and expensive repairs. But since this guy ran the test, he can change the thermostat himself or call a mechanic and ask that specific question. How much does it cost to change a thermostat in my vehicle? All this from the comfort of his own home. Now preventative maintenance saves a lot of money and heartache. So if you don't get this kit for yourself, you should really think about getting it for a friend or loved one.